Alright guys, it's been a while since um, I last did a video on FIFA. I've done a lot of streams. Um, I haven't really uploaded much. Well, actually, the last time I uploaded any FIFA, even streamed it, was uh, New Year's Day. Uh, funnily enough, but right now today, um, I debated streaming this, then I thought, now nah, I'm just going to open my rewards. If I don't get anything good, it's probably not going to even make it onto my channel anyway. Um, I See, I usually take the money. This time, I'm actually going to go for two Jumbo Premium uh, packs, gold packs, and then one Mega Pack instead. Could be a big mistake. Could turn out to be gold. Uh, you know, gold is in, you know, good. Um... But yeah, hope you guys are doing well. If you want to see more sort of pack openings and stuff and you want to see me do like challenges, like sort of challenge pack openings and things like that. So um, I had an idea of doing a video with my little sister, which is 12, um, of doing something like she has to say the player's name right. Otherwise, that whole pack gets discarded, something like that. So say it or lose it, basically, something like that. Start a new series like that on the channel. Um, you know, I can have packs and let them mount up. And then do like a say it or lose it at the end of the week or something like that. Um, so let me know, let me know what you guys think of that. And tell me what you guys want to see in terms of FIFA on the channel. Do you guys want me to do a career mode? And um, because I'm really torn, I'm not too sure. Um, would you prefer it streamed and then just uploaded as a video after the stream, or do you want to see more videos? So obviously they're a bit shorter than a stream. Do you want me to you know properly edit them and stuff or? Just let me know what you guys want to see to be honest because obviously I don't know if you guys don't tell me and it's a way that I can improve my channel and produce more content that you know you guys actually are interested in. Um, I've noticed that you know FIFA doesn't really do that that well uh, anymore as compared to you know what it used to. Um, this is my team that I'm currently working with so we've got Ellison in goal bought him. I figured I might as well go through my players and stuff just my squad and then we'll we'll open the rewards after you know so at least it's kind of worthwhile watching uh so we've got Alison Becker obviously bought him for 36,000 coins um I don't think that was too bad Trent as well I got him for 36k and we've got Toby uh Alderweireld for 50k um Harry Maguire in form uh, not in form sorry team of the week card for 40k we have Ben Chilwell, 37,000 coins for his Team of the Week card as well. Um, I, I have to say about my back line, it works pretty well. I used to have, well, I've had a lot of other variations, but, um, you know, it, it works pretty well. I like it. I love Trent. I'm really starting to like Ben Chilwell as well. Um, and Maguire is just solid. Absolutely love him at the back. Toby is a bit hit and miss for me, um, although he scored a screamer for me the other day. I think it was, was it, like, it might have been last night actually, like a 25 yarder um, just from after a corner. Brilliant goal. Um, we've got Ilki Gundogan, one of my favourite players actually. I bought him for 8.2k. Um, he has played 224 games for me, scored 32 goals, got 24 assists. Really, really nice card. Believe it or not, I actually packed Kevin De Bruyne. Guys, um, if I'm ever not streaming or recording and I pack anything good or score a good goal and stuff, please follow me on Twitter if you are on Twitter because I'll always post screenshots and uh, clips and stuff of FIFA on, on my Twitter. So go and follow me on there. My Twitter handle is the exact same as my YouTube handle. So, um, you know, barbix that you spell, however you want to pronounce it, I don't mind. Um, so go and follow me on there. I do tend to follow the majority of people back. If I don't give you a follow back straight away, just say, yo, I'm subscribed to your channel. The least you could do is follow me back. And I will follow you guys back, okay? Um, but yeah, we've got 24, uh, 24 appearances with him. 12 goals, 14 assists. A fantastic card. Absolutely brilliant. I'm still torn on whether... See, I like that three, but... I've got Ozil obviously sitting on the bench and I just think I could turn Kevin into a CM and put Ozil back there um, as Cam and I either lose Ilke or, or Fabinho, you know, they'd only drop down to the bench but still. I was thinking like, would that work well? I don't know. Um, so you guys let me know what you think on that one because I'm, I'm not too sure. I think I'm going to keep things as they are for now but if you guys think that would help massively then let me know. We've been doing pretty okay, actually, recently. Uh, Fabinho, well, we're on the record of him. He's another 
actual uh, a player that I actually packed and didn't buy. Um, so yeah, 80 games, 11 goals, 12 assists. Um, does a job mainly defensively for me. I'm not gonna lie. If if I'm moving forward, I'll tend to if if I'm choosing a midfielder, I tend to choose either Gundogan or or Kevin or obviously one of my front three. You know, to go for goal. Not really Fabinho, but he has chips in and he does do decently uh, when it comes to attack. I mean, he's got a medium to medium work rate, so he's he's not bad, you know. We've got Riyad Mahrez next up, 17,250 coins. I thought that was really cheap for an 85 rated uh, player, to be honest. So, especially a winger as well. So, I, I think, I feel like I really dropped on with that one. I, I don't know. Um, I usually tend to check foot bin, to be honest, to see what the going rate is. Uh, medium to medium work rate again great put us in a good shift for me he's chipped in with a couple of goals got uh, 20, uh, 19 sorry in total um, 13 assists for me good card Mares is one of them who is very hit and miss he's either brilliant or just goes missing all game bit like an Ozil in that regard um, and this is coming from an Arsenal fan so before you're an Arsenal fan that gives me shit for criticising Ozil like it, it's true I'm sorry you know it, it is true this was probably one of my biggest bargains, I think. Um, so you can see Alex Lacazette. I got him for 5.2k. He is brilliant, honestly. And I know my, I just said, I am an Arsenal fan. I might be a little bit biased. But, I, but honestly, I love his card so much. It does so well for me. And in fact, there's not a, any other striker I would replace him with besides an icon or... Um, Aubameyang, he is, Aubameyang is the only other striker I would replace Lacazette with, I'm that happy with him, honestly, he just works brilliant on the fix, a high, uh, on the pitch, a high to medium work rate, he's scored, uh, he's played 160 games for me and he's scored 106 goals for me, that is brilliant, 40 assists as well, absolutely phenomenal card, really, really is. Um, as well, I managed to pack Anthony Martial. This is going back. Uh, oh, actually, yeah, I just thought, I think I originally bought Martial. Then I packed this one, which was an untradeable. And then it swapped, so you can't really see his proper full stats because it's actually more of a newer card. But yeah, I'd, I'd, I've had Martial for some time. Another great, great player. It's similar, I think, to Mares in the same regard as... He's either brilliant or you don't really notice he's playing. Like, he plays okay or, or brilliant. On the bench, I've got Handanovic, who was just alone, really. Um, he's just there because he's the, you know, the second highest rated goalkeeper in my team. I've got Mandzukic. Uh, occasionally, I pop him on. I, I think he's scored for me. Yeah, he's got five goals for me. Only played nine games, so that's not really bad. Uh, David Luiz was great for me. He was one of my, uh, he was in my first team at one point as a centre back, and he, he was solid. I used to say it on a regular, like he's probably at the time. I think I had David Luiz and um, damn, who was my other, who was my other defender? Uh, someone pretty solid actually. Oh, Laporte. I had Laporte and David Luiz, and Laporte was good. But David Luiz was just insane. He was just consistently good. Ozil uh, bought him for 13k. He played 215 games for me. Scored 58 goals, got 52 assists. Good card, decent card. Kind of miss him. He just kind of sits on the bench now. Um, Naby Keita or Keith. I'm never too sure how you pronounce his name. I brought his Champions League card. Again, decent. Um, he does put in a shift. He's probably. He's, he's good where he is, I think, because um, he can come on from the bench and, you know, put in a shift defensively, help us out defensively a bit. Then we've got Bernardo Silva, uh, bought him for 3.4k. Again, I thought that was pretty cheap, to be honest, for a decent winger. Uh, he scored 26 goals for me, 36 assists, not bad. Mkhitaryan's a very underrated card. He always seems to do a good job for me uh, when he comes on. This is one that I got from playing Weekend League. We've got Tolisso, Petr Cech was brilliant, absolutely brilliant for me. And then I went and got the big upgrade of Allison, who is just a little bit better. Um, but that Cech uh, card sorry, is solid, absolutely solid. Anyway, 
Um, let's head over to the store. I'm sorry to have kept you guys rambling for about 10 minutes here. Let's open these fucking packs and hope that we at least get... I just want boards. At least boards. Surely I should at least get three boards. There's not going to be a board. So already I'm disappointed. That's going to be Valeri. 80 rated Valeri. Wow. That is not good. That is not what you want to see when you're opening a pack, really. That is... Not really what I want to go for, you know. But, um... I still think I'll get this video up for you guys, because, um... Even if we don't pack anything great, because... I haven't uploaded FIFA in a while. Um, I have qualified for the weekend league, so I should be playing that soon. Um, or tomorrow. Hopefully I can get this video uploaded today. <laughs> This is terrible. This is going terrible. Oh my god. I will be happy with just one board at this rate. Please god, surely. We've got to have something good. We have got to have something good. In this final pack. I could possibly open another one as well, in all fairness. Please. Please EA. For the love of God, give me something good. It's going to be good. Something that I can use. Okay. That's not bad, Pepe. I'm not going to use him, I don't think. I think I'm going to be better off selling him. Um. Okay. At least we got a Team of the Week card. I'm happy with that. This has been pretty abysmal up until this point. But I'm happy to get a team of the week. I think. I think I'm happy. <laughs> I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure, guys. I'm not sure how to feel about that one. It could have been Pele, you know. That that would have been that would have been pretty nice, I have to say. This guy's 86 rated. He goes for 44,000 coins. So I think we're gonna cash in on him, really. Um, because I just. I'm not going to use him, that's the thing, I just know he's not going to be used. So yeah, if we can get 44k, if you do pick up some background noise guys, it's my little Frenchie, uh, he's kind of lurking around my room at the minute, I don't think he quite knows what to do. Uh, I'm a bit, I'm a bit torn on that, we're going to get 44k for him, um, that's not bad. Does Keita sell for much now? He has a better rated card. I just feel like people would tend to go for that one. And how the hell do you pronounce his name? <laughs> Anyone? Yeah, he has a slightly better card. So I feel, yeah, I could get 1.3k. The thing is, I think it's always worth checking footbin because you never know what you could really, you know, cash in on really. Time before now, I've I've packed a card and I've just thought, nah, just discarded it. And people are like, you could have actually got a couple of K for him, to be fair. And I'm like, damn. Because <laughs> I feel like, especially in this FIFA, you kind of need all the coins you can get. Um, okay. I didn't, obviously didn't manage to get a team of the year or anything like that, unfortunately. The best I can hope for now is team of the season. But that's like... What's so bittersweet about getting a team of the season is it's a good card, but it's obviously like the end of FIFA, so do you even care at that point? Like, you know, realistically, do you, are, are you even bothered at that point? Now it comes to the part where my mate Flo, uh, who comes in my streams on the odd occasion, um, gets mad at me because I... I'm always torn on buying a player for my team and upgrading my team or opening some fucking packs. The thing is, there's only 7.5k packs right now. I feel like I could get shit. I could get absolute shit. So I'm gonna make I'm gonna make my my mate Flo proud and I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna stick with what I've got. I'm gonna hold on to them coins until some better packs come out, and then when some better packs come out. We could do a bit of a pack opening. You know, even 15k packs right now, I'd take. 
Anyway, I uh, hope you guys have a good weekend. And uh, yeah, this is just going to go straight up, I think, on the channel. Um, I'll be starting Weekend League tomorrow. Obviously, Friday. I did say I did just stream some Fortnite uh, just before I started recording this. And I did say I was going to be streaming some Weekend League. So obviously, I managed to qualify um, on the channel. That's going to be possibly just broken up throughout the day. I'm thinking that's my January, general plan even is to just you know try and get a bit done um you know and then have a bit of a break and then try again later and you know get some more matches uh under my belt but anyway thank you guys very much for watching this video hope you all enjoyed it um like i say let me know what you guys want to see on the channel do you guys want to see a career mode and if so what sort of career mode because obviously i'm an arsenal fan my first instinct is to do an arsenal career mode um but i'm not too sure what you guys want to see do you want to see more of a road to glory than you know a, a, me picking a Premier League team so uh, let me know on that one and obviously yeah I will see you guys tomorrow uh, in stream hopefully don't forget to subscribe um, and leave a like rating and I'll see you guys 